it's not deliberate, but just when I'm out on a run, I just will kind of like slow down and just look up and just kind of look at the trees and be like, wow, like I am so lucky, you know, just to be out here. If I went somewhere and there was a fence put up and I couldn't go in there, I mean, it would just be like mind boggling. I just wanted to serve. Became an airborne ranger, parachuted into combat, and served in Iraq. You know, it would be, you know, an afternoon, maybe cleaning equipment. All of a sudden, you know, rockets start coming into the base. The IEDs got really bad. When I got back home, I was always looking at like anything on the side of the road, like a trash can or a pile of brick, but always with suspicion. It, it, it took a while to get over. People ask me, you know, you run for so long, like what do you think about? I think about run because you have to, because you have to be really engaged in the moment. Those moments of clarity have helped me just calm all the, the noise. You know, we seek these experiences which kind of validate our ability to survive. Last year was a really big year. I completed the John Muir Trail, carrying all my own gear and food in a little over four days. The outdoors is kind of my playground. I guess I don't know what I'd do without them. Being outside in nature forces you to worry about the important things. Within 15 minutes, I can be somewhere where I'm challenged and it's really fun, you know, just to like be a kid and playing around. It's open for anybody. I think it's part of being an American is to be able to go out into nature and really get away from it all.